Good morning. So the question of the day is, should you enroll people at your lowest product packaging or your lowest product pricing with your company or middle of the road or higher? And and uh, so that's the question of the day. And because I've done it both ways very successfully, and I'm going to say it right out the gate, okay? There's no right or wrong answer, but there are more strategic ways based on your how you want to build your business. There's, again, so let's just talk about that. Now, here's the, let me just talk about why we... Uh, in usually enroll people at a higher package. Now, first thing though, before I get into that, by the way, my name is Tom Challen. This is my Uber driver. Say hi to my hi, Uber driver. Kim. This is Kim, hi, Kim, my wife, by the way. We are with Prior Network. We've been building network marketing for 23 years. We've built monster organizations of over 40,000 people. And this is the debate of the century. And it doesn't have to be a debate anymore. So let me just get this out of the way. When we offer, when we do a presentation, whether it's in our home, whether it is on a live stream, hang on, whether it's whether it's on a live stream, however we do a presentation, uh, hang on one sec, sorry. However we do a presentation, I'm just gonna hold it. Um, we always do package A, B, or C, and it, it, again, it could be A or B. Okay, it doesn't have to be. It could only be A. That's fine if you want to get singular focused and have people. Uh, do, do package A, that will work too. Don't overthink it. Just do it, okay? And if your company already has it where it's package A only, then just roll with it for a while and get good at it and roll 100 people and then you can modify it. Uh, you can modify it later. Uh, but why I do package A, B, and C is for this particular purpose. I've realized a few different things. My time as an owner is extraordinarily valuable. Number one, number that not in any particular order. Number two, people are already spending money somewhere else throughout their month. Look, we're in a we're in a booming economy right now. Amazon is exploding, biggest one of the biggest companies in the history of the world. You look around America, and the people that you think don't have any money are the ones that are shopping on Amazon too. So they're spending money, and they're buying products, they're buying services. Why, what's wrong with having them buy products and services from your company? What, why? why? Why do we have to bring people in at a lower product offering only, you know? And look, I know where a lot of that comes from. And I'm not saying this for all of you, but it either comes from, that's just the way that your company does it, that's the way that your upline does it, that's the way that, that's the, way that the top leaders do it, and, it, and it's what makes sense then do it, <laughs> then do a lower package and replicate that because low, lower packages are simple. They're, uh, they're great for mass duplication and it works. Um, but again, here's the but of why you might wanna consider offering at least another option. So if your product pricing is 160 bucks, let's say, to join your, your, your product offering with your company, you know, what if you had an A for 160 and a B for for three, what's 160 and 160? 320? What if you, oh, let's say it was 320. You'd be surprised, 20% or more of the people, they always like to go all in. They always like the bigger option. I'm that kind of a person. And if you don't have at least that option for people, they're always gonna go for the lower package. So the reason why number two, number one, my time's more valuable, uh, your time's more valuable. When you start to realize that, you'll start to attract more people. You'll get out of the people that have more of a poverty mindset. You'll go beyond the people that you think don't have the money or don't have the money. And the, the reason number two is double the volume. And it's not just better for me, it's not just better for you to get people in at double the volume, although it is double the volume. It's better for the person that you're enrolling, A, because they're gonna get more product, even if they're a customer, but B, if they are looking to do the business, they're gonna increase the value of their proposition, the value of their time, and if they're replicating, if they're replicating giving people an option for an A, B, or maybe even a C for 500, or maybe even $1,000, um, the volume could be double. Do you understand double the volume? That means you're growing your personal volume at double minimum to maybe three times minimum, should be four or five times minimum when you do it right, but it could be, and then guess what happens? What you do, they do. What you do, 
they do. So if you're doing this and they remember that they came in at a higher product offering, it will make more sense. Their confidence will be higher. It will be the normal. It'll be the normal standard, not maybe in your company, not maybe what your upline does, but it'll become the normal standard in what you do. And guess what happens when it becomes the normal? You normally are doing double the volume than everybody else in your company. Trust me. Don't trust me. I did this. Look, don't, don't just trust. I did it from a results perspective. So it's not, you don't have to believe it. It's true. It, it works. It works extremely well. Now, look, again, if you're caught up in that and you say, I don't see it, you know, why do I have to bring in people at a higher package? Let them do what they want to do. Do it then. Do it. Don't overthink it. Okay. I'm serious. I, I, I don't, I'm not meaning this. I, I'm serious. My team, I create a loving, firm, a, a truthful environment of what it really takes to grow. And one of the best ways to, to grow a business is to increase the value of your offering and increase the value of the product offering. It only makes good business sense. And again, if your company says, your upline says, no, that's dumb, it doesn't work, why do you have to do that? In almost every other corporation around the world and other network marketing companies, it's a standard process to offer the best value. You're not trying to get people to buy things they can't afford, you're trying to give them the best value. Because again, they're gonna spend their money this week. Why not have them spend it with you? Why not have them invest into their, their, their health if you're in a wellness business or whatever your product or service is, okay? Uh, Julie Vance, thank you for that. Julie says, the higher packages helped me rank three times faster. And I could tell you hundreds upon hundreds, there's no way I would be doing millions of dollars of volume in my teams over the years without my whole team replicating that, multiplying that. It's just so much better. I can't even, I can't even put it into words. I wish I can spend hours and show you the math difference on it. And I'm telling you, it's all of a mindset. It's a mindset. If you're worried about it, you gotta really check where that's coming from. It could be a poverty mindset, and I'm not saying you have it. I know I had it for years. I don't wanna pay for training. I don't want, I wanna, I always brought people in at the lower packages for years. I did it. And then when I realized it, how to do it the other way, my business, my life changed forever. And I'm telling you, even if you only double it, it'll, it'll double your personal volume. And then let's see what your team does. I'll be surprised. By the way, um, let me know who you are, would you please? I would like to know a little, tell me something about you. Tell me some one thing about you, if you don't mind. I'm serious, I'm reading it. I will comment on every single one of you. Um, if you're here, if you're watching the replay, and hundreds of you are gonna watch the replay, please let me know one thing about you. What, how long you've been in your business, maybe your biggest frustration, maybe your biggest blessing, how long you've been married. Oh, I really wanna know. Please put in the comments below and share this. If this message, if you know you need to have someone hear this message, please share this, okay? All right, God bless you. Say bye, honey.